how's it going guys today i'm going to show you how to uh, put a integrated headset together so just done my unboxing with my damn side conspiracy grip tape and a tilt headset so what you want to do is take off your forks and everything from your deck mine's an aos v4 so that's it yeah <laughs> it's quite simple take out the bottom bearings take out top bearings good uh, put them to the side and undo your new headset so mine red top cap so even though it might look a bit weird oh well i like the red got some stickers that i'll probably add later and then the headset in the box so what you can do take out the bottom put the box to the side and um the headset if you're running ihc like me when you buy a fork so mine blunt cnc um it comes with the compression bolt and the compression shim i need to take off my bottom um top cap or the top cap that i've used for a long time it's a bit broken so you get this uh the compression thing that sits there i can't remember what it's called with the fork um when you're using i when you buy a headset it comes with this thing an ihc this one if as you can see is a bit wider uh you have to use the one that comes with the ihc otherwise it won't work so this one put it to the side even though you're not gonna or you might not use it but you might um so that's the top one just pop that in there uh just to put it to the side this is a bottom one and comes with this it's called a crown race um and what it does you pop it if your fork's older it sits here and um it sits on there because some uh forks don't have an integrated or like a one that comes so when you put the bearings on and it goes on there that goes in and then it could spin round but if you can put if your fork doesn't have one it slides on then the bearing goes on and then it works like it would with um new forks because my forks new headset just goes straight on first you're going to want to grease it so i've got this grease spray just give the headset a little spray so it won't seize up while it's in there that to the side giving it a little spray already and then just gonna slide so this way down the pointy bit always goes in the deck so as it's edged like that kind of points up point wants to go in the deck so when you're putting the top bit in point goes in this bit the point goes in and you want to slide the fork up make sure it clicks in well it will go in there we go now it's in uh then you want to get the other headset this and then just give it a little spray as well so it won't get greased up or it won't like seize up there we go All nice slide the bearings in um first sometimes you want to like to uh just tap the bearings in make sure you have like a plastic or not plastic but like kind of rubber nylon thing i've got my allen keys nylon so just give it an even tap there we go that's even enough as you can see uh then the bottom bearings just feel yep that's it fine the fork again slide up sits nicely then you want to get this black thing oh wait there we go slide the black thing in pop it there um so it's forks fine then you want to get your compression shim and make sure your bolts greased because sometimes it seizes up as well wait where's crown race don't need that throw that away well you can keep it but you're not gonna use it and pressure bolt greased and then just gonna tighten it up uh, 
and just slide or just tighten that up all the way all the way and then make sure it's tight as you want it so that's yeah some headsets they like you listen to that doesn't make a noise some headsets uh, you need to like wear them in so always have it like with new headsets have it like a little loose um just so they won't like they won't get really tight and then you need to wear them in and then it'll start getting quicker so ooh, come on Alki. there we go make sure it spins nicely doesn't make a sound spin good then i'll slide the top cap over all the way down give it a little tap because oh, sometimes they just don't go all the way down because it's like they're new so they haven't been used just taking the stickers off quick pop them to the side put the top cap on Make sure it spins nicely. My uh, top cap was broken, so when I um, put the bars on and everything, and like without a headset spacer, this um, it used to go like, and it used to actually catch on the top of the deck. But because I've got a new one, it doesn't catch. So have your top cap how you want it. Mine says like tilt, always at the front. Make sure it's in line. That's good. Then. All you want to do is just slide your bars on and then just tighten up the bolts and then you're done and then take it for a little while don't go as hard as you normally would um, when you're like riding it's like with your old headset you want to just you know just kind of get used to it because it's a bit you know, cause it's new and yeah just wear it in a little and then it's all done so that's how to um put an integrated headset together with ihc uh if you liked or it's basically the same with SES as well um apart from you use the standard like compression ring that i put in you don't use the one with ihc then you just uh, put the top cap on and then put the SES clamp on so it's quite simple and then HIC, all you do just the same as SES, so you just put the things in, put the uh, bottom bearings, top bearings, the normal compression thing that you get, pop that in, uh, and then you slide the uh, top cap on, then you put the shim and then the bolt. But with IHC, you put the top cap over the top and put it on last. So thank you for watching. I'm Ollie Fenner. Make sure you follow me on Instagram at Ollie Fenner. Subscribe down below or to the side or wherever it is i think it's there uh subscribe and leave a like put in the comments whatever you want i don't care so and i always read them so thank you for watching i'll see you in the next video bye